Welcome back to this final match, the second men's match of round one here at the Z Open. And obviously he's got a pretty uh, pretty decent ranking. You can see that he, he looks technically solid, looks pretty strong. Yeah, he's a very busy bee with his movement, isn't he? Quick off the ball, quick off the tee, looks very light, very agile. Not sure how that made the front wall from Gordon, but he got it, his racket onto it somehow. Two quite contrasting physical specimens, these two. No lead. Both players look very fit, but they're very tall, Chris Gordon, very languid in this match. Tight. Just slightly fortunate there, clipping the side yeah, wall, but it was the right Vargas area Vargas and it was the right thing to do for Vargas to take the ball early on the volley, and it's causing Gordon some problems. Oh, what a get. I mean, it's a wonderful shot. And again, some great reactions from both players. Wonderful exchange, but just too good. Just there too early, really. The movement has been and a real problem for, for Gordon. Probably a good tactic, at least for a while. Just trying to stem the flow a little bit, coming from the, the racket and the feet of the Colombian. Just going back to the coaching in between games, Parky, it'll be quite an adjustment. It'll be interesting to see whether players choose to have that back in their corner or they quite like it without. Yeah, it will be interesting to see how many players actually do it during this event. It, um, I'm not sure if you know exactly how long it's it's been implemented that you, that you couldn't coach. It feels like it's been a couple of years, Seven, but two. I really don't know. Yeah, just since COVID really. Yeah. Left side. As we came back from that stint off tour. Goes to game ball. He's got eight game balls now, the Colombian. It's been some really long rallies and Chris Gordon's certainly been in, in it. It's just that the end of these long rallies has been usually at the losing end, especially in this game. It's hard work. Do putting in a lot of work there, Gordon, but everything was coming back from Vargas. Well, Parky, is this going to be a three lover? Or is Chris Gordon going to pull something extra special out the bag? It's looking like um, the former, unfortunately, for the American, because that, uh, 
He's put some nice shots in, but Farkas is so quick. He's got the answer to absolutely everything. And then he's got the winners as well. He's capable of putting the ball away like that last shot. Again, the error comes from his racket. It's a nice touch. Shit. He drew him in there. That was pretty, much pretty special. You can see Chris Gordon looking at his opponent, shaking his head. He really didn't have much chance. That was a impressive performance from Vargas. First time I, I've seen him at all, really. 11-4, 11-2, 11-4. A surprising result. 29 minutes. 